Our next speaker is one of my fabulous colleagues, and I mean fabulous in the Department of English and Film Studies, where she is also Associate Chair of Graduate Studies. Professor Julie Rack is the recipient of a Shirk Connection Grant and organizer of the Autobiography in Transit Conference. Julie. Well, I'd like to thank everybody for coming, and, I, and uh, it's an honor to be here. I'm not talking about my research today, really. I'm talking about an event that I organized that Shirk made possible and that many of the people in this room made possible. So I'm glad for that opportunity. I was also told by the organizers that I had to make it fun. And some of you know that I'm all about the fun in scholarship. But, uh, and I probably used up a whole minute telling you that. This is a quotation from the conference report written by Seraphima Kennedy, who is a graduate student at Oxford University and who is part of their life writing online project. Yaba 2014, which is the Autobiography Transit Conference, is likely to go down in autobiographical scholarship history, not only as the place with the best view, best banquet, and best wildlife, but also as that conference where that theory was first propounded. Yaba has ruined me for future conferences, wrote one of the delegates in an email a week after the event. She was not just talking about the buffet. And so she wasn't. What was she talking about? This is the, a conference that is sponsored in part by the IABA, the International Autobiography and Biography Association. That association is almost unique in that it has no dues. It collects no money. It exists only to circulate and make scholarship happen. It only exists to bring people together so that they can share ideas about what is called self-life writing sometimes, other times called automedia, other times called autobiography or biography, which is the study of the stories that we tell about ourselves virtually in the so-called real world and also in writing, in video, and in all sorts of media now, all across history, all over the world. This organization, in other words, doesn't make money it makes ideas happen, so we need Shirk to do that for us. So why was this conference such a big success? I'm gonna let you finish, wrote one Ayaba 2014 delegate on Twitter, but Ayaba 2014 literally has the best people of all time. Why do they have the best people of all time? What made this work? As I've told you about Ayaba, but this conference was unique. People who were there, and I know one of you was, agree. It had 150 attendees, 30 of them graduate students. Shirk supported them at the Banff Center for, for Culture and the Arts, and, the, and you know if you've been there that it can be expensive, that the community building and the world-class uh, facilities at the Banff Center have a price, and graduate students often cannot participate in those things. Shirk made that possible. The attendees were 50-50 international and Canadian. One of the goals of this conference was to showcase the best of our thinking and our creative activity in Alberta and in Western Canada. We did that. Some of our writers included Pat Fred Waugh, Patrick Lane, and Sharon Prue Turner, who is a Métis author. If you have not read her work, you should. And those people come from Alberta and also from the BC interior. And we wanted other people from all over the world to see how good their work was. So we showcased life writing. We were at a world-class venue with its focus on scholarship. The keynotes were vital to success. But one of the most important things that happened was we had a workshop for graduate students that was attended by the big stars in the field. And we don't have big stars who don't care. <laughs> Our stars actually do care about graduate students and the future of the discipline. So we help them with professional work at this particular workshop, and that helped them form their own virtual network about the study of life writing. So they're taking what we gave them, all of us who have been in the field, and they are taking it out into the world on their own. They have the tools to do that. Shirk gave them the tools to do that. Thank you, Shirk. Thanks, all of you helped me with that. It was a 150-page application, damn it, and we got it done. Thank you.